Hello viewers, welcome to Ekamaya Second. Today we are going to discuss about an important protected area as well as a species in which there is a recent survey conducted to protect this particular species. Let us understand what is the species we are referring to and what is the protected area that is also in use and what are the key outcomes of the survey conducted in the recent context. So let us understand the species which we are referring here is wild ass. Let us understand more in detail. So first the context of this is recently there is 10th population assessment of wild ass. So that is what with the name VAPE. Wild ass population assessment survey. So this is a 10th such survey and it is conducted every 4 years once. So you have to remember like how tiger census is conducted every 4 years once. Same is the case with the of wild ass also. So what is this found actually? So it was conducted by the state government of Gujarat and there is a significant increase almost 26% increase in the population of wild ass. Now let us understand more in detail. So what are the key findings of this wild ass, wild ass population assessment survey of 2024? So just as I told you this is the 10th survey and it has found almost compared to the previous survey where there are 6000 species of wild ass. So there is an increase to 7600. So this is the present number. So that means almost there is 26% increase in the wild ass population and this is conducted in Ranov Kutch. So Ranov Kutch in Gujarat. So this Ranov Kutch includes both little Ranov Kutch in great Ranov Kutch in the Gujarat. So Gujarat state government has conducted this survey and they have found significant increase almost 26% increase in the wildlife population of this wild ass and we also need to understand they have deployed modern technology modern technology like camera traps camera traps drones okay so these type of things were used to detect the presence of wild ass now let us understand more in detail what is the conservation status of wild ass so first we need to know this is considered to be an endangered species under IUCN red list and it is also scheduled one animal in the wildlife protection act of 1972 so this is the only wild ass species found in Ranov Kutch district of Gujarat and there it is called with a name called Kutcher so the locals call this as Kutcher. So in future also examination point of view this is important. So they can ask you which type of animal is named with this term called Kutcher. Then we also need to understand what are the government related initiatives. So as I just told you there is periodic survey almost means every fourth year there is periodic survey to identify the assessment and also they have taken some measures to increase the prey or the food of this particular wild ass. So they have taken enough measures to increase the grassland cover in the wild in this particular area as well as they also have taken some measures to increase the food availability for this particular species. Now let us understand wild ass sanctuary. So where is this located? It is located in Ranov Kutch of Gujarat. Ranov Kutch in the Gujarat and we also need to remember this is the only habitat of wild ass only habitat of wild ass like you have Asiatic lion only surviving in gear protected area right so same way here also we have this is the only surviving habitat for the wild ass population and then this is also in the dry deciduous and deciduous and thorny vegetation vegetation kind of habitat this is the main thing we need to understand and this is a significant area why because it is considered to be an ecotone ecotone means it is a transition zone transition zone between two different ecosystems but here it is the case of wild ass sanctuary we are discussing right so this is a transition zone between terrestrial that means land based ecosystem and marine ecosystem so it is a transition zone and you know generally when there is a transition zone there will be lot of biodiversity that means edge species that is what we refer right so there will be lot of biodiversity in the eco zone compared to the 
boundary areas. So this is one another thing you need to remember. Then this region is also famous for salt production. So salt production and there are also there are raised platforms called beds. Raised platforms are common in this region which are formed by erosion and all that is called in the local language with the name beds. So this is one we need to remember and this is the only surviving habitat of the wild ass population. Then let us see the practice question given for the day. Which of the following statements is incorrect about wild ass? So is it a herbivore? Then it can adopt to extreme desert conditions. It can exclusively be found only in India and its population is concentrated in the little run of Kutch. So among these options which you feel is incorrect, try to answer in the comment section. Then today as part of our video discussion we have discussed about wild ass and its related population assessment conducted in the recent times by state government of Gujarat. We also have discussed the species related information as well as wild ass sanctuary which is situated in the state of Gujarat with practice question. So if you liked the video and found informative let me know in the comment section. Thanks for joining. All the very best.